you worthless, impotent, empty suit of a cereal brand. I will donate $25,000 to the charity of Cheerios Choice if they simply use their official account to tweet, fuck you. I will double it if they target the Twitter account of an actual non-famous random user and do it. The next day, Cheerios responds on Twitter with, you know we're a family brand, so we can't just drop the F-bomb. We'll donate $50,000 to No Kid Hungry. We'll also donate $50,000 to the charity of your choice if you tweet, families make good go round. So of course, John Oliver responds back on Twitter with, it's a deal, families make good go round. Please RT with a photo. And then if you scroll down, you can see, hang on, sorry, wrong photo. Use this one instead. Families make good go around with another photo. And then one last one, we promise, families make good go around. We apologize, we've been informed that one of the photos we may, ha may have involved murderers. We're looking into this and we'll get back to you. And then he goes on to say, if you're not going to tell a random Twitter user to F off, then we will. And what's really cool is if you go to this particular user's Twitter page, you can see that they've actually been rooting on this whole cause, which is pretty awesome. They actually asked a volunteer the first day that the episode comes out and then tell Cheerios, like, hey, it's a good cause. Can you just do this for us so that you can make $50,000? They're disappointed that Cheerios doesn't actually tell them to F off. And then if you scroll up a little bit further, they can now finally rest in peace that John Oliver has told them to F off. So this has been a really cool story. A lot of money got donated, so pretty awesome. Thanks for tuning in. Please subscribe if you like this type of content. We'll catch you next time.